Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Amy D. Today I am gonna be cooking a recipe, a new recipe at that for you guys. So let's get started. Like why am I even gonna do the talking, right? Like let's just get to it. I have never done this recipe, I will say that much. And I have all of the ingredients except for shrimp. So I'm just gonna make chicken carbonara pasta. Ah, so excited taking everything out of the fridge and I think this is gonna be great honestly I'm excited I have been wanting to make this for a while and today just happens to be the day so let me get all of the ingredients and we'll get started with okay, the rest so I will say this this is not a traditional recipe so I am making it with the ingredients that I have you can choose to make it with whatever ingredients you would like for yourself and for your recipe I did not go out of my way to go and purchase any specific ingredients for the recipe it's just what I have so it's what I'm gonna make so of course you're gonna need some chicken breast that I already took out of the freezer I told you guys you're gonna need some heavy cream I am personally using these bacon crumbles that I already have because I don't have regular bacon. But if you wanted to, you can actually use Canadian bacon, which is the traditional recipe, or you can use regular bacon and then just cut it up into pieces. We have some butter and I am going to use these toasted red peppers for it. I like the recipe from Olive Garden, so that's almost like the one that I'm gonna try to mimic. And of course, I have my spaghetti pasta, salt, garlic, pepper, and paprika. And I think I already talked about the butter, but that is it. Are you ready? Let's go. First things first, I'm gonna cut this chicken breast in. Now I'm getting some water ready for my pasta. I have removed the chicken from the pan, so now I'm going to start prepping the sauce. I'm gonna actually do it and then show you guys what that looks like. Like a true chef, you always have to taste your sauce. I recently went to go eat somewhere and their sauce needed salt. I'm like, did you not try this? Or what? Mm. It is good, but it's missing a little bit of salt. This sauce is so beautifully done and it tastes delicious. Delicious. I'm now waiting for the pasta to finish. And then I'm just gonna pour it in here and then the chicken at the end and... I'm boom. literally just here eating the chicken because it's so good. Like everything individually tastes so good. You guys, es que el que tiene sazón tiene sazón. Like put a recipe in front of me and I will make it. I promise you. Especially when I really want to cook like when I'm in the mood to cook and I just want to make something very very good Or for a loved one and I'm just so excited to You know like this is my love language cooking for people is my love language and cooking for myself is my love language <laughs> Look at this. I just poured the noodles in here and the chicken. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I don't have parsley to garnish it, but you can add it for yourself. 
Let's serve it and try it. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is so, so good. It's like the perfect creaminess and just taste. The bacon bits did wonders. I didn't really need regular bacon or whatnot. The bell peppers add the best flavor ever. I love chicken and shrimp carbonara. I didn't have shrimp, but next time I'm making it with both. This is good. This is good. Whoa. I just finished everything. I literally ate every single thing, you guys. <laughs> Ay, pero estoy muy llena. Gracias a Dios. Okay, now we're going to continue with our day, our vlog, because why not? You know what? In the beginning, this was just going to be about the recipe, and it was just going to be about, like, making food with you guys, but I want to hang out because honestly you guys have no idea how much it helps me to number one stay busy but also number two like just be here present with you guys sharing all of my intellect <laughs> or just sharing you know what i have in my mind sometimes and right now as i was washing the dishes because if you were to walk in the kitchen you would not be able to even tell that i did anything over here i put some away for lunch tomorrow and then another one that i'm actually going to be giving to a very dear friend of mine as i was washing the dishes i was thinking that i should get ready and i should make tiktoks and that a lot of the times we are in our minds and overthink a lot of whatever it is that we may be going through because we're not busy enough and when we're overthinking or when we're latching on to people or when we are attached to people and we cannot seem to let go is because we have a lot of free time in our hands not to take away any of your feelings because of course all of your feelings are valid however we need to stay busy so cooking i would and i wish i could do this every single day right like i wish i could just go to work come home and be like the super power woman and like cook a whole pasta meal and then wash all the dishes and then keep continue to work and like just be like all power mode right it's not always like that we have seasons and that's okay but today i have the energy so today we're gonna do it so i'm gonna go get ready because I actually have something very cool coming up for you guys that I do want to share. So I'm going to change because I'm also going to yoga later. And today is also game four of the Lakers versus the Nuggets, which I really hope the Lakers win. But I don't really think they're going to win because like no team in the history of NBA or the NBA history has ever come back from a 3-0 you know, like Lakers, come on. We could have Kobe's looking down at us like what the fuck are y'all doing? Anyways, let me get Tú me hubieras dicho siempre la verdad. That's it. That's the quote. <laughs> oh, that's the quote. Okay, so I told you guys I was gonna be going to yoga. And so I changed. I am wearing my yogi or my yoga actually crop top that was gifted to me by the place that I actually go to. So it's really, really cute. It's a crop top. And I am wearing these shorts. And yeah, I put my little ribbon because I feel cute and I feel very feminine whenever I wear it and I love it. Um, I have literally been wearing ribbons since I was a little girl. <laughs> and... I've told you guys this in the past, but in middle school, I used to just match my shoes with my ribbons all of the time. And then now as an adult, I just love to wear them. It just really makes me feel better. But guess what? I am gonna make content for TikTok. I'm so excited. You guys, I love making TikToks, TBH. Like, they're such short videos, but so informational sometimes. And I just get inspired. Other times I just, you know, I'm a little bit silly. And I like to, you know, just throw jokes out there. Sometimes I say or talk about things that have happened in my life. Other times I talk about 
other scenarios that have not happened in my life but that a lot of people could actually relate to so it's kind of funny because sometimes people think it's about me and it has nothing to do with me or like my situation and I love it <laughs> I love it I love it because people will be like are you good are you sad are you happy depressed like y'all I'm good <laughs> like I'm really really good and you know you would be able to tell if I wasn't because honestly I can't fake the funk <laughs> I just can't so yes I am gonna get ready to create content. And in case I have not told you guys, there's going to be a Memorial Weekend sale for Dulce de Labios. I know you guys love when we bring out the sales. And it's summertime, like summertime is coming. I want you guys to have all of your favorites. Lip gloss is all of your favorite lip oils because you're gonna need them. I want you guys to have everything and anything that you want to try at a more inexpensive price. Excuse me as I put on my lip oil because i love it number one and number two i'm gonna create content so i just want to make sure that my lips are not you know all chapped or whatnot this is one of the new ones mandarin you guys it has a little bit of a shimmer a little bit of a glitter but it's doing what it needs to do you know what i mean like yes anyways everything on the website is going to be 30 percent off so you are more than welcome to get as much and as many as you would like I love giving back in whichever way that I can and this is one of the times that I give back with the sale for Dulce de Labios. So I hope that you guys meet me there and I'm still trying to figure it out for how long we're going to go for. I think it's probably going to start on Thursday at 5 p.m. We're going to do something like that and it's going to go all the way through Monday. So I know some of you guys get paid Wednesday, other people get paid Friday, other people, you know, like I get it. So I'm trying to make things available for everybody at the same time. And yeah, I love it. And I love you guys for always supporting. I love you guys for always, you know, just being there. If you have not tried any of my products or you have been wanting to try something, but you haven't just been able to afford it for whatever reason, this is your time to shop. This is your time to get a discount. And well, this is also your time to enter for a giveaway. Ah! Okay, I'm so excited. I hadn't told you and I was gonna wait. You know, I really was. But what I'm gonna be doing is anybody who puts in an order for this weekend, However big your order is, however small your order is, whatever it is, you guys are going to go into a raffle where I am going to gift you your order. So whatever it is that you order, whatever it is that you purchase, you are going to enter for a chance to get your order for free. So after the weekend, once the sale has ended, I will get all of the orders and put them in like a little raffle thing and like just pick a winner and we're gonna go from there and i am just gonna refund you your money so make sure this is like one of the first times that i'm actually doing a giveaway this way and i wanted to try something new for you guys but also because i just want to give back in whichever way that i can but also i want you to choose exactly what it is that you want to buy for yourself or for whomever and yes so ahora see, i'm gonna make content for All right, you guys, so I pre, I was gonna say pre-edited, but I didn't pre-edit. I pre-filmed some TikToks that by the time you guys see them, you're gonna know when I made them. But you know, there's a lot of things that I have in my mind to share, and I think a lot of people can relate sometimes, and I also think that it's just fun, and it's funny, and it's okay to have fun, and it's okay to have all sorts of feelings I'm, I'm a i'm a person who feels very very deeply and i love that about me you know i i truly do i i used to feel like it was a weakness of mine but it's no longer a weakness of mine and i don't let it dictate um my life either so ahora sí, i am gonna chill for a little bit and then i'm gonna go to yoga to get my stretch on because i did some chest and triceps yesterday or like upper body sam and i went to the gym and i also haven't been eating necessarily the healthiest i was eating out and i did eat out a lot this weekend hence why i cooked even if it was pasta but you know at least i cooked it at home so i knew exactly what ingredients were going into it so it's a lot healthier than it being from an outside source <laughs> so i'm gonna kick it and then we're gonna figure Ooh. that out all right you guys guess what 
yes it is another day another dollar we didn't finish the vlog that day because we just got busy the lakers lost i went to yoga after yoga i went to the yard house and went to go watch the game and i kind of already knew they're gonna lose but it is what it is anyways i just got home from work and your girl is craving some cereal and we know we got some cereal the other day and i also got milk so i'm about to eat me some of that because why not <laughs> i love i literally just thought of like who would have seen me as a little girl eating cereal at 2 p.m not my mom not my mom <laughs> here we go Yeah, buddy. Ooh. Mm. This right here. Period. Oh my goodness, you guys. Huh. Well, I was in between going to the gym, going to yoga, staying here and just meditating and not knowing what to do or just chilling or whatever but honestly i don't know what's up with this weather <laughs> but also i feel like i'm just gonna rest excuse me yeah i think i'm just gonna chill <laughs> for the rest of the day and we'll see probably cook later or whatnot but i'm gonna leave this here Thank you guys so much for being with me another vlog another day i appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart make sure you don't forget the sale for memorial weekend starts thursday 30 percent off and one of you blessed because no we're not lucky we're blessed one of you blessed winners is going to get your order 100 free so i will see you guys there and then, until the next one.